Holiday meals in my home are not complete without a delicious holiday salad. So let's make one together today. Stay tuned. Hi, my name is Katrina. Welcome to the Organics channel, where we are committed to bringing you healthy recipes, supplements, and nutritional advice to help support you in your healthy lifestyle. Today, we're going to be making a holiday salad with roasted onion. Let's begin by slicing our red onion. Chop off one end and then cut in half lengthwise. Remove the outer peel and slice off the remaining end. Begin slicing, making diagonal cuts towards the middle. Once halfway through, lay your onion flat side down again and continue slicing. Place your sliced onions onto a baking sheet. Drizzle with one tablespoon of avocado or olive oil and toss to coat. Sprinkle with one quarter of a teaspoon of either pink Himalayan or sea salt, along with one eighth a teaspoon of cayenne pepper. Toss together again and then roast in a 400 degree preheated oven for about 15 or more minutes, just until you get your desired doneness. While your onions are roasting, let's make the dressing. To a small saucepan, add 2 3rd cup of balsamic vinegar, along with 1 quarter cup of orange juice, which was about one orange for me. Bring to a boil and then let simmer until it reduces down by about one half of the volume, about 11 minutes. Once it's reduced down for an extra boost of collagens, whisk in two scoops of our clean sourced collagens powder. We are now ready to assemble this holiday salad. Begin by taking eight ounces of your favorite mixed greens and to it we're going to drizzle on our dressing. So you can either serve this dressing still warm or you can just stick it in the refrigerator to cool it down. Depending on who you're serving and how you're serving up your salad, you may want to keep the dressing on the side and just let everyone put on their desired amount. Okay, so now we are ready to add in our roasted onions. These are delicious, by the way. And you can just roast them to your desired doneness. I like mine a little bit more done, so mine have a lot of caramelization on the ends. Next, I have one half of a cup of chopped up walnuts, but you certainly could use pecans here too. One chopped up apple or pear, I'm going to use an apple. And the secret here to stop your apple from browning is just take a half of a lemon and squeeze it right over top after you chop up the apple, toss it together. It's amazing, this apple has been sitting for quite a bit during my filming and it's not brown at all. Plus it adds a little bit of flavor to it, it's really nice. Last, I'm going to add one quarter of a cup of Parmesan cheese, or you could substitute this with feta cheese, or just leave it out completely if you don't eat cheese. Okay, we're ready to give this holiday salad a taste. One other thing that you can add on top of your salad if you'd like is some dried cranberries, or dried cherries, or pomegranate seeds. It's always really fun to add in that color red to your salads for a beautiful holiday spread. Okay, let's give it a taste. This salad is delicious. That's all I have to say. You know what I really like? Is those caramelized onions when we added a little bit of cayenne pepper when we roasted them. Mmm, gives it a little bit of spice, which I always love. I love the crunch of the apples and the walnuts. And definitely adding in just a little bit of sweetness from cranberries or cherries or pomegranate seeds like I just uh, spoke about would be really good in this salad. I hope you give it a try. Here's wishing you a healthy, happy, and joy-filled holiday from all of us here at Organics. Take great care, and I'll see you next week. Bye-bye.